Domino. Ah, oh, my curious little minds. Today, I'm going to reveal a sticky, sweet secret. Have you ever wondered how bees, those tiny, buzzing workers, make honey? It's not magic. It's science. Bee science. So sit tight, open your brains, and get ready for a journey that's going to make you say, buzz-tastic. How do bees make honey? Did you know that this sweet golden goo was made by buzzing little butt wigglers? I mean, seriously, who thought, hey, let's eat what bees throw up? Careful, young explorers. We are entering the secret territory of the busy little bees. They buzz, they fly, they dance, and they make honey with their mouths. And no, it's not magic, it's buzzing biochemistry. But if you ever see a bee dancing on a wall, don't worry, it's not a hip hop contest. She's just giving her friends an exact flower GPS. Amazing, right? Okay, so let's recap. Bees suck up nectar from flowers, store it in their special honey tummies, and then pass it from one bee to another, like a sticky game of telephone. Each bee adds something special, enzymes that help turn that nectar into real honey. And do you know how many flower visits it takes to make just one jar of honey? Almost two million visits. That's like flying from here to the moon and back, just to make a snack. Bless you, Domino. Don't worry, we're not making you fly that far. Shh. Keep your antennas down, team. I've disguised myself as a bee. Pretty convincing, right? All I had to do was borrow a very, very fluffy sweater and learn to wiggle my butt. Ayumi, Domino, quick, suit up. We've got a top secret mission, Operation Buzz and Sneak. If we don't look like bees, we'll stick out like, well, like a cat in a beehive. We're about to explore the hidden wonders of the hive, the baby bee nursery, the royal kitchen, even the honey spa. But remember, no sudden moves and absolutely no sneezing. These bees are serious about their work. Ready to be undercover agents? Then let's buzz in. Welcome, my little pollen explorers. Follow me quietly, and don't forget your fake antenna. We need to blend in like real bees here. First stop, the hive spa. Oh yes, even bees need to relax. Hot honey baths, wax massages, and zen buzzing music. Look at that worker bee. She's got honey up to her neck, and she's floating in happiness. And now, ta-da, the nursery. Hundreds of baby larvae, each in their own cozy cell, getting fed royal jelly and lullabies that go bzzz, bzzz, baby, all day long. Adorable, right? Let's move on to the bathroom. Not for showers, no, for cleaning antennae and little bee feet. Hygiene is super important here, don't be surprised if a flying towel comes your way. It's automatic. Now to the kitchen. It's a buzz fest in here. Mixing nectar, adding enzymes, stirring, storing, and okay, maybe tasting a little. Shh, don't tell anyone. This is a real sugary science lab. And get this, it takes over two million flowers to make just one jar of honey. Makes your head spin, right? And finally, the dining hall. Thousands of bees munching on pollen, royal jelly, and of course, honey. It's like a flying cafeteria where everyone goes bzzz to place their order. Domino, please don't lick the floor. Before we head back home, it's time for a little souvenir shopping spree. Just look at this honeycomb gift shop. There are honey jars in all shapes and sizes, bee striped socks, a t-shirt that says, I survived the royal hive, and even a plush queen bee that goes buzz kisses when you squeeze her belly. Domino wants a honeypot keychain, but he already licked it. So it's officially his now. I'm grabbing a gift for daddy, one for me, and one for Domino. Don't tell him, it's really mine. I'm pretty sure I'll have the stickiest backpack in school. And that's the end of our buzzing adventure inside the beehive. We saw honey spas, baby bees, busy kitchens, and even a souvenir shop full of sticky surprises. I think Domino ate a little too much honey. 
He might stick to the floor. <laughs> now it's quiz time. Are you ready? Here comes your honeybee quiz. How many flowers do bees need to visit to make just one jar of honey? A, 20, B, 200, or C, 2 million? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And the answer is C, 2 million flowers. That's right, bees are super workers. Domino thought it was 20. But that's how many flowers he eats just for fun. Thanks for buzzing along with us today, little explorers. See you soon for another adventure with Ayumi and Domino. Boop,